And the floodlights are shining down on the players here in the Spanish capital of Madrid. We're at the Bernabeu. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as always, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Real Madrid versus Cadiz. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. And the keeper throws himself at the ball. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. And a struggle to get it away properly. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. out and started the game at a terrific pace and really could have taken the lead there only denied by a very good save from the keeper and Real doing well to win it back Benzema and Benzema making a more than decent run oh big chance well 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 players would have the confidence to try that simply magnificent well just look at this again the speed of counter-attack is so impressive and the finish is sublime he sees the keeper's position and just chips it over him it's a breathtaking goal and the match back in business Real Madrid with the advantage Vinicius and return to Benzema crossing into the middle taking care of business defensively here Vinicius Junior well just narrowly wide of the post that time Negredo Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? Just the challenge that was required. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. Now, who can he play it to? Look at Modric! And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. And fired over by Kors. Over the byline, hence a goal kick. Ivan Alejo. Well, he successfully got past him. Can they square the game? Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Playing it in, not the best clearance. Well read to win possession back. So on the cusp of the half-time interval and Real Madrid with a narrow lead. Stuart, what have you made of what you've seen from them in this half? Yes, they've defended really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. we are going to have two additional minutes and the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu well, usually...
Well, it is advantage Real after the first 45 minutes, but there's a long way from being settled. Chance to play it in. A oh, super piece of play. Terrific save. Cross with the corner. And the problem not completely solved. Well, they can keep possession now. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Alex Fernandez. Now with Alcaraz. Lucas Perez. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted. And you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. And a long way out here. Well, you saw what he was trying with that free kick, but the goalkeeper had it covered all the way. He's got the right idea with that pass. Karim Benzema just needs to keep his composure. And a goal it is. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And this is Benzema at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the goalkeeper. It's a brilliant goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Ruben Alcaraz. We're getting the ball forward. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Now this could really lift spirits. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. David Alaba and into the last 15 minutes of action and just failing to bend the run enough and the flag has been raised substitution for Real Madrid Very quick thinking there. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Opportunity. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. And there's the delivery. Well, not the best clearance. Lucas Perez. Could pull one back here. Which he does. And maybe, just maybe, there's enough time for an equaliser. It would be quite the frenetic turnaround. Well, here's the replay, and you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play, offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? And so into the final five minutes. Aurelien Chouameni. Now potential danger. Can he put it away? It's still alive. Just cleared away in the nick of time. Negredo. Lucas Perez with it. And that is that, the end of the game. It goes into the books as a win for Real Madrid. What did you think of?